Hey guys, Ray J. I'm October 27th at 7.29, so yeah, um, I decided only to do lives for the holidays, <laughs> so like Halloween, that's pretty much how I started doing lives, was, uh, for holidays, so Halloween, Christmas, uh, Valentine's Day, maybe... Thanksgiving, I don't really celebrate, but <clears throat> we'll see. But at least until I get monetized, because like I said, most people do chat and sit on their phone during chat and don't do music. All they do is like drink or do talk for two hours straight, and I don't do that kind of thing. <laughs> so, <clears throat> as you guys know, that's not my thing. So, I'm not going to uh, go out of my way just to do lives and then people... Like I said, the last live was really bad when people kept talking, calling me names. And they kept telling me, oh, don't have music on, don't clean, you gotta sit here and look at us. You can't wipe down your DVDs, it's like, for two hours. And I'm like, that's freaking boring, seriously, I need my music. <laughs> so, after that live, I'm just like, no more, no more lives, they're just not as fun. <clears throat> it's just uh, too annoying. Because like I said, originally it was for my friends. But, uh, yeah, so I'm not going to do lives anymore except for holidays. So, Halloween, Christmas, and I guess New Year's, Valentine's Day. So, yeah, I think I did, uh, I think I did lives last year for New Year's. I can't quite remember. But, yeah, I'm going to try to do New Year's live. Um, and then I'll just vlog it at the same time. Like, Probably, like, the last hour, like, 11. But last year, yeah, I did do it last year because uh, Dean was the only one in live. So I was <laughs> talking to me and Dean for, like, the past two, three hours <laughs> when I was smoking outside. So it's kind of funny. But, um, yeah, so I'm just going to do lives for uh, holidays, like I said, because, like I said, I'm alone. Even though I have family, all my family has uh family outside so they gotta go see them on holidays and then we usually get together like our christmas isn't until like february march kind of thing we still celebrate it just not till later because like i said all of us are kind of scattered around <laughs> so and then they always invite me to places and i'm like i don't want to be around so many other people that i don't like that they're family but not they're not like a blood family right so that's why I started doing lives on, during holidays and on Christmas. So I did a live, so that was kind of fun. But then once uh, my birthday came along, I was like, oh, let's do live every single day until my birthday. See what that's going to be like. It's like, why did I do that? Uh, it's just, uh, I guess it does bring in people. But at the same time, it brings in the wrong people. It brings in the wrong quantity quantity over quality and another thing i was going to say too because i know people are going to be like oh you're lying about how long you've had their so your swollen pee for anema whatever you want to call it so again i'm bad with math i can't count with crap <laughs> as you guys know so for now i'm just going to say i've had it since i was 20 years old because now i remember it since i went through my files and stuff but yeah it was when i was uh, since I was 20, like I said, because originally it wasn't swollen all the time. It was just during heat, but I count all that together when it first started. And so, yeah, like, uh, my doctors keep saying, because I had, because I was a surviving triplet, again, broken record, <laughs> because I had to share a small little womb with two other kids that didn't survive, and I didn't have enough oxygen, enough nutrients, all this stuff, and now I'm 44, so once I hit 20, everything went downhill, pretty much, year by year by year, I started getting things, like, when I was 20, it was my swollen feet, my hearing and my teeth, I was born with it that way, but my feet didn't come until I was 20, the unknown chicken condition came when I turned 40, so, like, 10, 20, so that's 20 years later, I get something else, <laughs> And then chronic fatigue, it didn't happen on my birthday, but it happened like this past year. 
So, and then the anxiety, but that, like I said, I think the anxiety has to do with because my cat's passed away. I don't like being around people or that, and that's another reason why I don't want to keep going to doctors because people don't realize I take transit. <laughs> and even if I drive or, like, get a ride, I still got to be around people. I don't want to be around people. This is why I stay <laughs> It's like, no, I can't stand even going, like, shopping and stuff because there's just so many people but i do make um a habit to do a drip event at least once a month so then that way i could still be in contact with my friends and a lot of my friends also have issues too so like i know a lot of people with chronic fatigue syndrome and a lot of people with uh anema i know a lot of people with and I know chicken condition, <laughs> surprisingly, is very common now. And they still don't know. There's, like, some people can't get any help whatsoever with it. But that's why I keep saying I have all these issues. And that's why I keep saying my doctors and my and everybody that I've seen about this, they all say it's from the way that I was born. Because if you think about it, you, you'd understand a little more. <laughs> it's not just one thing that I have. It's multiple things. And then as you get older because you're stuck in a small tight space you don't get everything that you need so when my cousin keeps saying oh you gotta go to another doctor in the state so maybe they can figure something out you're probably not going to <laughs> and if they do they're only going to figure out one thing they're not going to figure out everything it's like I keep saying, I've had issues since the day I was born, so it's not like any of this is new. So it just gets very, very irritating. So I keep bringing it up. Because <laughs> I'm like, watch my YouTube channel, damn it, then you'll understand. <laughs> but they don't. So some of them do, but some of them don't. But yeah, I got my cane here, my trusty cane. I should just whack them with the cane every time they say that. <laughs> go to the doctor whack now you gotta go to the doctor <laughs> now you gotta go to the doctor uh two and a half minutes i really wanted to watch two and a half minutes yesterday so yeah i'm not done cooking yet i just uh did the toasted the bread just to cut up onions and tomatoes and toasted that and then i cut up the tomatoes and got rid of the bad stuff bad parts and then just put it in a container so now I just got to put together my sandwich and all that, but I am going to go for a smoke. But I just wanted to let you guys know that I've decided I'm only going to do live on holidays. That's it. Um, Because I do vlogs. And again, my vlogs, as soon as I record a vlog, like this vlog, it's literally going to go up as soon as I push stop. So I'm going to upload it right away. So it's pretty much like live. There's really no difference other than people talking to me. So... <laughs> I think that's another reason, too, why I prefer doing vlogs now, because I get more done. But then with live, everybody's talking, and I'm like, I can't focus. I can't do what I want to do. And again, it's not your, your guys' fault. It's because I've got conditions, and there's only so much energy that I have, and I can't keep up with everything. It's like, so to sit in front of my phone for two hours just talking, <laughs> to me, it's a waste of time. I mean... At first it was fun, but like I said, once you get the trolls and all that, and I feel like I got ambushed kind of thing. And I'm pretty sure the copyright strike didn't happen, only happened during my live, that was it. So I'm pretty sure it's because I went live. So yeah, no more vlog, no more lives, sorry, no more lives until, except for holidays, so Halloween, Christmas, New Year's. Whatever, whatever holidays are there. <laughs> Those are the ones that I celebrate. Christmas, Halloween, Valentine's Day, St. Patrick's Day. And that's if I'm going out for an event for, like, the, what do you call it? On that day, for, some, for whatever reason, then I will, but most likely I won't. Like, I really wanted to go to, they have a thing down at UBC for Christmas. In December, and I was like, oh, let's all go to, let's all go down to the market thing there. And I'm like, nah, I'm probably going to say no. <laughs> just thinking about it. Like, I just, I got to get dressed. I got to go all the way down there. And then I got to spend money and spend time with people. And then I got to come home. No, I don't want to go through all that. <laughs> 
So I be I've become a hermit. <laughs> a hermit is what I like to call it. But like I said, I prefer being on my own, especially on days like this when I have my teen and I can't do crap and I'm in pain twenty four seven. Like I can't even talk too long because I'm just so in too much pain and I yeah, it's just uh <laughs> Let's tell you how it goes. Ah. I was going to make salad dressing, but I'm like, no, too much pain, so. And then I'm going to go for a smoke, though, and then I'm going to put my sandwich together and call it a night. So, probably all the videos I'm going to do today. Because, like I said, I'm just in way too much pain, so. Um, I will sh uh, No, I won't show you. I mean, you guys have seen it before. I make the same pulled pork sandwich. 20, many, many times, but I live, live, eat, learn. It's in the fridge, so I don't want to go get it. <laughs> like, like it's too, I don't want to go get it. But I got the sandwich here. The bread, anyways. And then I got the tomato. See, like, I don't even want to, like, walk, really, at this point. And then I got tomatoes here with the onions. There you go. So you guys see it. And then, like I said, it's a vegan pulled pork. But I'm just in too much pain to, like really do any videos or talk to anybody right now, unfortunately. But, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna call it a night. Like I said, I'm just gonna go for a smoke, put my sandwiches together, and, uh, then go for another smoke, and then feed Phantom Bud, warm up my sandwich, eat, and then go to bed. I really wanted to watch Two and a Half Men yesterday, but it was at, the power was out, so they like, dang it. <laughs> So, thankfully, it came back on. But, yeah, if you guys wanted to know, because, like I said, uh, cleaned behind the fridge, and the fridge, the oven, that's what I found. <laughs> behind the oven, oops, there goes my cane. That's what I found behind my oven. There are my sunglasses and my hope angel. <laughs> I was wondering what happened to that, so I washed both. I did tons of dishes here, so I need to get my game, otherwise I can't, I can't even move right now, it's, that's how bad it is, so yeah, uh, dishes, so, oops, pretty good, I almost slipped through, so, yeah, and I fixed the healthy Halloween sign, but like I said, as soon, whenever it gets to this point where I have to use my cane, I usually just rest and I take a leaf, and that's what helps. And then tomorrow I should be back to my old self. But tomorrow I'll also have to go get, um, what do you call it? A few paper bags. And do laundry and some time with family. So I'll probably do, uh, videos when I'm going out to get paper bags. Oh yeah, and I have to go shopping. I have to get icing sugar and cat food. So, because I still have 20 bucks. And then on Tuesday, I just go pay rent, and then we go to Chickpea, and then I come home, and then Wednesday and Thursday, and it's Halloween, so yay. But yeah, like I said, I don't make money off lives, so for me to do lives, it's really not the same thing. Like, there's a lot, like, Amber Reed and Slightly Toasted, and all these other people that do lives, like, plus Cindy, they all get money through Super Chat, and that's why they do it, so, I don't get money, unfortunately, but like I said, I literally post the video as soon as it's done, so it's pretty much like you're watching it right away, so, there's really no difference, <laughs> there, there really isn't, other than I don't have, like, 20 people going, hey, it's me, it's me, it's me, it's me, and then I, it's me, it's me, it's me, it's me, well, I got blocked. Why did I get blocked? But, like, all this surreal. <laughs> like, even the last, what was it? After my birthday, that live, I kept, I even got messages on my Instagram from somebody saying, I got blocked, I got blocked. I'm like, during live, and I'm like, oh, seriously, I'm trying to <laughs> do live. And I'm like, that's right, I'm trying to figure this out. And it's like, that's so why I'm like, at least when I vlog, it's just me. I don't have to deal with everyone else. So, 
Or people will be like, hey, you got to message so-and-so, and you got to message so-and-so, and you got to do this, and you got to do this. And you can't be friends with so-and-so, and you can't be friends with so-and-so, and we don't like them in your lives. It's like, <laughs> I'm not going to do live. So, yeah. And then those stupid people that keep saying, oh, the cops are on their way because uh, uh, you don't like Trump. <laughs> he doesn't give a rat's ass about me. I'm Canadian. <laughs> I'm Canadian. So, anyways, I am pretty happy, though, that Beyonce and Taylor Swift are both supporting Donald Trump, so I'm pretty sure he's gone now. <laughs> After getting two powerful ladies, yeah. For hers, I don't think many people are going to vote for Trump. <laughs> but we'll see. Um, apparently, they're still, I think the last time I checked, they're still trying to figure out if it's conservative or NDP. So I haven't looked lately because I've been in too much pain. But yeah, I was almost thinking of going live on that day to watch that to watch the countdown, but I don't think I have access to that kind of thing. And like, do I really want to go live and have all the Trump hate people and all these people over here just go, "Here's Trump, Paris, Trump, Paris, Trump." Not really. <laughs> so it's like, nah. But it's so funny how many people keep saying in life, Oh, the cops are knocking on your door right now. <laughs> None of them do. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that's... Uh, there's just so many reasons why I don't like, like live. Like I said at the beginning, it was fun because I was getting to know you guys. But even then, we weren't really talking much. It was more like me doing stuff, so... But like I said, YouTube is supposed to be for me. It's not for you guys. It's for it's my outlet. So if I don't like doing lives, then I shouldn't have to do lives. And like I said, I do long videos. I do short videos. I do cooking videos. I do craft videos. I do cleaning. Videos. I do so many different things. So it's like, and then on top of it, I need to do live. No, <laughs> I don't think so. Especially if I can't even do what I do normally, which is cook and clean. So, yeah. So, no more lives except for holidays. So, that's where we're going to leave it. <laughs> for now on. No, no more lives except for holidays. That's it. That's it. And I'm done with the drama. <laughs> I'm done with the drama and the harassment. And if that means less viewers, then fine. So, yeah. If you guys only watch me because of lives, then... Probably don't have your notifications, <laughs> I guess, because I'm only going to do lives for uh, holidays, so. But yeah, I'm trying to think of all the holidays now. Actually, no, I, St. Patrick's Day is Irish. I'm pretty, I'm, oh yeah, and then Pretty Cougar Day. Can't forget that Pretty Cougar Day. And then my birthday. So, yeah. My hip is killing me. <laughs> it's like right here. It's driving me nuts. So I've been putting, I put a uh, biofreeze on it. So hopefully that will help. <laughs> Cause that's good for your muscles. And then I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna go for a smoke. And then come back, finish putting my sandwich together. Feed, uh, and go for another smoke, and then feed Phantom Bud, and get ready to go back to bed, because now it's pretty much 8 o'clock, so at least I'm going to bed at a decent time. And if it turns out that I wake up halfway through the night, then that's fine. And if I don't feel like going to get the paper bags tomorrow, I might just wait till next week. <laughs> yeah, or Tuesday. I'm actually thinking of, yeah, I'm probably going to message them and let them know. I'll just, I'll just go get them Tuesday, because that's when I got to pay rent. So, I really don't want to go tomorrow. <laughs> and then there is all these free different kinds of food on uh, Buy Nothing Groups. So, I'm like, hey, I'll go, I'll go pick it up. And then I found out where it was, and then I got to walk, like, five, six blocks to get it. I'm like, no. <laughs> I can't walk. I got a damn keen. <laughs> I can't walk, so, yeah, so I'm going to call it a night, and, uh, so like I said, for now on, just vlogs, 
and no cooking and cleaning vlogs until my copyright warning is gone. So, like I said, less videos for you guys, but at the same time, it kind of makes, makes me feel better in a way, I guess. And like I said, you guys can always leave comments. It's not like no different than live, really, other than that I see it literally right away. <clears throat> and I see 20,000 different messages at the same time, so... Yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna call it a night, because I'm in a lot of pain. In a lot, a lot, a lot of pain. And... I will uh, let you guys know how I feel next time I'm awake. I'm just getting a lid for the container. So yeah, before anybody says, oh, you said you've had it for 14 years, don't quote me on, don't quote me on math, because I don't know math at all. Probably not 14 years, 20 to 30, 30 to 40. So 20 years, I think. See, I can't even count. <laughs> so yeah, since I was 20, I'm now 44. So you could do math, that's how long I've had. Have these swollen feet? And one time it got so bad that I actually got sent to the hospital overnight because it went purple. And then it went back to normal. So they're like, okay, I could go home now. <laughs> you ran all the tests. We don't know what's wrong with you. That's pretty much what they say. That's why I go, I could keep going to doctors after doctors after doctors and neurologists. And, oh. and they just keep saying the same thing. You don't know what's wrong with you. You're normal. Your kidneys are fine. Your heart is fine. <laughs> Your lungs are fine. I've had my lungs tested. I've had everything tested that you could think that I even had a what was it called? Wolfson test. <laughs> so it's like, yeah, I've had Parkinson's disease tests every every single test that you could think of. The only thing I haven't got my test done was Actually, I did get my heart tested, but through the machine, I didn't get the, uh, I think there's a surgery or something that you're supposed to get where you have a tube hooked up to you or whatever, but I don't know. But apparently, like, too, that uh, a lot of people in my family get swollen feet, too. So, that's the other thing, too, that it runs in my family. My aunt had it, my grandma had it. Uh, a few other people had it, and it gets to what I showed you guys earlier today. That's the worst of it. So, <clears throat> they had it, too, for many, many years, and doctors kept telling them, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. So, but thankfully, thankfully all they had was swollen feet. I have everything <laughs> that you can think of. So, yeah, I feel like I'm 100 but this is why, again, why I love Freddy Krueger and Phantom of the Opera so much. Because, like I keep saying, I feel deformed half the time. I still feel deformed. And that's why it helps to have Freddy and Phantom close by. It's my it's my comfort. And some people, some people get it, some people don't. But that's how I go on. And so, yeah, there you go. 23 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so I've been rambling I've been ranting a lot today about the same thing but like I said I'm just so frustrated of everybody bugging me about the same thing over and over and over and over and over and over and over again so if you guys are annoyed you know what I'm going through <laughs> so I'm letting you guys know so you can so you guys could be put up, be putting up with what I'm putting up with on a day-to-day -day basis since I was born <laughs> Do this, do that, do this, do that, do this, do that. I'll pay for your trip to go to New York and you can see the specialist here. I'll do this for you. I'll do... Oh, uh. <laughs> I'd rather have that money go to groceries, not a trip. <laughs> to go find out, oh, everything's, everything's the same with you. Uh. <laughs> so annoyed. So yeah, anyways... Story of my life. I'm gonna get. I need a smoke, so I'm gonna go. Where? Well, first I'm gonna go to the washroom. Upload this video, and then go for a smoke. Watch North of sixty. Make my sandwich. Go for another smoke. Watch North of sixty. Feed Phantom Bud, and then call it night.
So, hopefully tomorrow there'll be a little more videos. But like I said, if I'm doing laundry tomorrow, then probably not as many. But we'll see since I'm not cooking and cleaning anymore. It's just me talking. So, I'll just be updating you guys throughout my day. And yeah, I'm just going to go get the paper bags on Tuesday instead. So, anyways, no lives until... Halloween and only holidays because you guys get vlogs and vlogs are better than lives in my opinion You're on Phantom Stores. Have a good night and keep on going. Thanks for watching Like, comment, share, subscribe. Welcome to my Haunted World episode, episode of the Upper Ghost.